In this video, we will show you the inside bar trading strategy that works. And no one talks about it. Not knowing this key is the reason you will spend years failing. After watching this video, you will learn to identify inside bar to trade like a professional that took us years to discover, which will make you good profitable trader. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and hit the notifications bell so that you know exactly when new content is released. Also, let us know your questions and thoughts below or video topics you want us to cover as we always take your comments into consideration and love hearing from you all. An inside bar pattern is a two bar price action trading strategy in which the inside bar is smaller and within the high to low range of the prior bar. The high is lower than the previous bar's high and the low is higher than the previous bar's low. Its relative position can be at the top, the middle or the bottom of the prior bar. The prior bar, the bar before the inside bar, is often referred to as the mother bar. You will sometimes see an inside bar referred to as an IB and its mother bar referred to as an MB. Some traders use a more lenient definition of an inside bar that allows for the highs of the inside bar and the mother bar to be equal or for the lows of both bars to be equal. However, if you have two bars with the same high and low, it's generally not considered an inside bar by most traders. Inside bars show a period of consolidation in a market. A daily chart inside bar will look like a triangle on a one hour or 30 minute chart time frame. They often form following a strong move in a market as it pauses to consolidate before making its next move. However, they can also form at market turning points and act as reversal signs from key support or resistance levels. Inside bars can be traded in trending markets in the direction of the trend. When traded this way, they're typically referred to as a breakout play or an inside bar price action breakout pattern. They can also be traded counter trend, typically from the key chart levels. When traded this way, they are often referred to as inside bar reversals. The classic entry for an inside bar signal is to place a buy stop or sell stop at the high or low of the mother bar. And then when price breakouts above or below the mother bar, your entry order is filled. It's worth noting that these are the classic or standard entry and stop loss placements for an inside bar setup. In the end, experienced traders may decide on other entries or stop loss placements as they see fit. So if you are enjoying the video and found it helpful, please leave a like on this video and a comment as this goes a long way and helps support our channel. We appreciate it. So let's get back to it. Let's take a look at some examples of trading with the inside bar strategy. In this example, we can see what it looks like to trade an inside bar pattern in line with the trending market. In this case, it was a downtrending market. So the inside bar pattern would be called an inside bar sell signal. Here's another example of trading an inside bar with the trending market. In this case, the market was trending higher. So the inside bars would be referred to as inside bar buy signals. Often in strong trends like this one, in the example, you will see multiple inside bar patterns forming, providing you with multiple high probability entries into the trend. In this example, we are looking at trading an inside bar pattern against the dominant daily chart trend. In this case, price had come back down to test a key support level formed a pin bar reversal at that support, followed by an inside bar reversal. Note the strong push higher than unfolded following the inside bar setup. Here's another example of trading an inside bar against a recent trend or momentum and from a key chart level. In this case, 
we were trading an inside bar reversal signal from a key level of resistance. Also, note that the inside bar sell signal in this example actually had two bars within the same mother bar. This is perfectly fine and is something you will see sometimes on the charts. Trading inside bars from the key levels of support or resistance can be very lucrative as they often lead to large moves in the opposite direction, as we can see in this chart. Now, if you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful, please show your support by hitting the thumbs up button, subscribing to our channel, and turning on the notifications bell so that you can keep up to date with new content releases. Also, leave your questions and thoughts below. If you want to know more about trading and investment, you can check out our website, fxtradinger.com. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.